Hi! Today I would like to show how you can synchronize the Behringer Pro 1 to the Volker FM. It will then sound like this. First you need a sequence in one of the two sequences available on the Pro 1. With this button you can choose Off Mode, Play Sequence 1 or Play Sequence 2. With this button you can choose to record a sequence. I will not go into details about recording a sequence here. There is a very good video on YouTube showing this. So to activate Sequence 1, slide the slider to this position. Now the tempo for the sequence comes from this LFO slash clock button. And you can override this tempo by injecting the sync pulses from the Volker into the gate clock input. Now the LFO clock button is useless and you can control the tempo with the Volker FM. As we have learned before, it doesn't matter if the Volker is playing or not. This of course behaves differently when you use the sync output of the Volker mix which only sends sync pulses as soon as the play button is pressed. But as you can hear, he doesn't reset the sequencer to the first step, so he just continues where he has left off. But of course you can use this free warning behavior to your advantage. The sequence length of one sequence is up to 64 steps, which is quite a lot. So two things to keep in mind if you do this. First, the Pro 1 advances in his internal step sequence of one step as soon as he gets one pulse. That's pretty easy. On the FM you have two modes to set up the pulses, which the FM sets out, and you have three modes to set up the speed of the internal sequence. At the moment everything I have shown you is in the one pulse every two steps mode and in the half speed mode. So this means that for every step there will be sent out one pulse. If you change this to full speed mode, then the Pro 1 will run with half speed compared to your Volker FM, because every second step will be sent out on pulse and every second step the Pro 1 will advance one. If you then change this to one pulse per step, you are even again. The other thing is just while well, some variation of this in the one fourth mode, he will send out four pulses for one internal step of the FM. So you can, uh, together, together with the 64 steps the Pro 1 sequencer has, you can do some variations about the length compared with the Walker.